Guys, in this video, we're going to do a Shopify dropshipping product research. Before we start the video, I want to show you this funny t-shirt that I used to wear when I worked my 9 to 5 job. It actually wasn't even sometimes 9 to 5. And I used to gain like $8 an hour, which was horrible. I mean, uh, I also worked at McDonald's. And it's funny how now I can actually make in one day what I actually in then made for like one month, right? And working my butt off, guys. And now actually, it's funny how... Online and opportunities just in this world this time. It's so easy and simple more than easy It's simple if you know what you're doing to make you know the money you're making one month working your butt off But now you can actually make it in one day So I'm gonna show you exactly how in this video how to do Shopify product research So you can actually know how to find those proper products that can make the money you actually want if you want a more in-depth uh, step-by-step guidance and my personalized mentorship so you can actually start your journey and start doing dropshipping, making money passively through your laptop. You can actually check out my course first link on the description, guys. All right, so let's get started. I also want to remind you that in this video, you're going to learn things that you've never learned before. You know why? I'm going to tell you why. Because actually, my top selling product is a product that does not have a five-star rating. So every single product, you know, Shopify product research video there is out there, always tells you to find products that have five star ratings and that's really fine that's great i'm going to actually go over that also but i'm going to show you exactly how to determine it and how to know if the supplier is a good supplier without even that product having a five star rating so let's dive into my computer and let's start so we're just going to use random uh random products for this video because i really don't want to show you exactly you know what product because that you need to research videos you want to find a top selling niche all right so in this case, we're just going to do the, uh, we're going to go to men's clothing. So it's just random. I would never suggest you do this because that's what gurus teach you. That's what the fake gurus teach you. Just go to best sellers and pick a product. And that's not how to, the way to go. All right, guys. Also, you know, a, a, the clothing niche is, for Shopify is really competitive. I would never go into that unless I really know how to do marketing. And, and you know what? I really do know how to do marketing. But what I mean is if I really, <clears throat> in your case, if you're starting, <clears throat> I wouldn't go with this, right? If you're actually, you know, uh, further on, you really start knowing how to run your ads and more than ads, how do you actually creatively uh, do your post and advertise and videos and all that? That's going to actually leverage more of this, all right? So we're going to go and found this hoodie and so let's see. All right, guys. So before I, I tell you exactly where to go, we're going to show exactly that you need to put here. But I'm going to show you exactly how you can also find products that don't have a five, five star rating. All right, guys. The criteria I'm going to follow is definitely see the supplier. The supplier is one of the most important things, more than even the products, because the product can have five star rating, but it's probably only one one review. And remember, guys, these reviews can even be from the supplier. I mean, I can actually tell my friends to review my products, and I can and, I, and they can actually fool the the, the buyer. And, and and but th this is actually from them, right? So actually also uh, have that in mind for example this Nutella t-shirt it really is a great product because it has it doesn't have to be free e-packet I remember when I used to start uh, drop shipping I used to click this free shipping and this is a big mistake I used to make because it only appears the only you know the only products that have free shipping free e-packet in this case right but that was a big problem because I was missing out on so good products that had like 0 0.50 cents or maybe three dollars shipping but that the cost and the, you know the price of the price was a lot lower but in that case I was missing out so now I do not click on the free shipping I only click on the five star rating why because definitely if the products are appearing on the first page it's gonna be based on you know their quality and the order so I definitely want to click on that one They're not necessary on the have five star rating guys make sure you like this video because you're gonna get so much you're gonna be like wow I never thought I was gonna actually find those type of products without you know using the criteria right guys so for example this case it is really good product but it's kind of expensive right guys so you always want to double check the price with Amazon so I, as I told you before go to Amazon go to a lot of you know online stores and compare the price to see if you can actually get profit for example this has a processing time of five days if you want to compare also guys comparing products is great because if you product frankly same as this one it's just different supplies which one am I going to choose <clears throat> This one costs ten ninety six. This one costs eleven. This one free. This one free. It's seven days. So definitely, I'm gonna choose <clears throat> the one right here. <clears throat> Sometimes they just put like different uh, ranges, and it's pretty much exactly the same. So it's gonna go to review. So let's just click this one. 
I also want to sh show you right now something cool you can do when you find your products. I really like finding a product that have pictures and feedback, all right? So the second step you're going to go over is see if they have feedback. <clears throat> when you get a feedback, you use advertisement. That's a little tip, guys, for you guys. So take notes. What I actually like to do is sometimes in some products, I actually go and see the feedback. And then if they have pictures wearing the t-shirt or wearing the bracelet or using the product, that's going to help me a lot. And it be, because if it's a good quality picture, I can actually use that to run an ad for that product and using that picture. So sometimes people just like seeing how it looks on them or how it will look on them. So having pictures of people wearing it or anything, it's going to be much better than the simple product on a blank uh, you know, in, in, in blank picture, right? So you mass, you must also check that out. For example, this one said perfect, everything fine. So another thing I would like to do is to test these products. You can actually do is share this picture. All right, take notes, right? Nobody's going to tell you this. Free value for you guys. Share that picture on a group. See how many likes you get. See how many engagements. See what, what people say. If people like the product, that's going to be a lot better. In this case, it's going to be a little bit harder because this is just a hoodie, right? But what if you share, for example, for a dog? What if you should go to dog groups and you start sharing, for example, uh, you know, a leash, you know, a colorful leash or uh, that had lights on it, and you share it on a dog group on Facebook, and people just start saying, you know, where did you get it? Where you bought it? You know, I want this, I want that. Boom! You know, it's a hot selling product. You know, a lot of people want it, so that's an awesome way to test products, guys. So you just got a lot of value, not just for product research but for testing. And a lot of things have to do with what people want. It doesn't actually matter what you want, it matters what, what your audience and niche wants, right guys? So obviously you gotta, sometimes freaking things are just ugly and you know are not gonna sell, but still don't get guided by only that, all right? Test also. So after you've seen all the reviews, got my jumper, it's good quality. So you know it's quality, you know, the, those, you know it says the fast delivery. So here also, you can actually, on the feedback, you can actually tell what exactly people think of this product. If the quality is fine, if the shipping, I've seen products that they say, the shipping, I'm sorry, they say, for example, the quality is great, but the shipping took a little bit too long. And I checked the country also. Obviously, it's, for, it's, if it's from the USA and they say the shipping is too long, then that's pretty something I would probably get my eye on and probably stay out of. But if it's obviously from a country, for example, if I ordered from Peru, my country, and it's like, oh, it took too long. Yeah, obviously it's going to take too long because that's why I'm in the U.S. market. doesn't mean I haven't got, uh, you know, sales from other parts of the world. So this is a great product. I mean, it only has five and four star ratings. I would also like to check if it has one star rating, just one. Fashion looks net XX me a Spain car tabbing. All right, so this means like if I see this comment, it doesn't mean it's a bad product. This person just saw it like I don't even know what it means, but it, it's not bad, like too small, right? So this person just ordered a wrong uh, short size, like things you probably have to be warned of. All right, so let's check another product. So so I can actually on. Let's just go and check dog, right? Dog. I'm gonna show you exactly products that don't have a five star rating. So guys, now you know that it has to have EPAC, you guys. Also, it has to have, so write that down, it has to have EPAC, and make sure you also like the video, EPAC it. Also the reviews, also the shipping can't be that long, guys. I mean, normally from the US, it takes from 12 to 20 days to arrive. That's pretty fine, that's great. A lot of people ask, you know, Andre, are people gonna argue, are you gonna get mad about the long shipping times? And I say no. Uh, as long as you have it on your shipping policy and people know it's gonna take that long, or they can actually go back and see, all right, it's gonna to to take from 12 to 20 days. Besides the processing time, they'll be fine because they know you told them, you didn't lie to them. All right, guys, so that's why I always see, I always target, try to target to the US market because that's gonna be the best and fastest shipping time. All right, guys, so for example, I'm gonna go to this one, and for example, if I go to this bed that's, uh, it's not bad, it's 949, I can actually tell that this supplier has a top, it's a top brand. All right, so a lot of things you have to follow is that you, when you actually go to product research and for your Shopify store, you, and if it's a good supplier, check out the rating. For example, this one, it's a top brand. This right here that's a metal, this metal means it's one of the best suppliers there is. It's a top brand. AliExpress, on AliExpress, you definitely want to check out your, the reviews. And actually, what for example, this one has, also it's a top brand. All right, this one is also top brand. Normally, the top brands appear at the top. Also top brand, also top brand. 
So what I actually do is go here and click on this brand. I know this product is going, it's great. I can actually compare the price with Amazon. It has e-packet, it doesn't, it doesn't have to be free though, but it, ha it has e-packet in time, five days. I really always, it's gonna be like that. Uh, also, it has great reviews. We can actually go, it definitely has, I'm gonna show you how to actually find hidden products, all right? And products that don't actually necessarily show off and this is something you're gonna learn, guys. Make sure you are subscribed because I know I'm providing a lot of value. And if you wanna see my journey to hitting 10K subscribers, I want you to be part of the journey and say, you know, I was here when he had like 2K, 3K, 4K, 5K, and now we're reaching 10K, guys. So please support the channel and I'm gonna drop a lot of value. Also make sure you drop a comment, drop a like, and just ask anything you want because I'm here to help you out, all right, guys? All right, so if you don't wanna work in NFI like I used to do. <laughs> all right, so we go down and we, can see all these supplies products and the beauty of this is that all these these products are not necessarily ranked high on aliexpress what this means is that you can actually put like dogs or dog leash or anything for any niche and you're not going to found you're gonna you're not going to find these products but this supplier is a top brand so you can definitely trust the supplier so this means that any product that you choose, even though it doesn't have a five star rating, is still a great product. So this is a definitely way that nobody, guys, nobody's teaching you how to find products also. So if you see a beautiful product from this supplier for your niche, obviously, they, sometimes they have a lot of different categories. Just go in your category. For the sake of the video, we're just gonna go on anyone, but look, you can actually sell product, bath, kitchen, kids, bath, sports, pets, they're just going random and it doesn't matter because I just want to show you exactly what you can do with any niche for your Shopify store. So we're going to check out that this supply has a lot of products, all right, guys? And it's a top brand. So as I said, you can have definitely trust. For example, this, if I wanted to buy this product, this product does not have a five-star rating. Although I know if I order this product and I import this product and I start selling this product, it definitely is going to arrive and it's going to arrive and it has, it's a top supply, it's a top brand. AliExpress know that all the products really has a lot of trust. So let's just go in this one. Imagine I would like to sell these, you know, sell these small hoodies right here. I would actually could because it's a top brand. Okay, in this case, guys, it does have a foot. What I'm going to tell you and what I want you to understand that you can actually pick any of these products of a top brand or a high selling brand and still make money. And I'm going to tell you that I actually, my top product, my, you know, the product that gives me the most profit is actually from a product that is from a top brand that does not, and that product doesn't have a five star rating. It definitely didn't even have a rating. Definitely guys, obviously if you see a top brand that has, you know, for example, two star rating, from three reviews, obviously stay off, stay out of that product. But if they have like zero, you know, reviews and zero rating, don't have a rating, then you can actually check out probably it's a new product or people just couldn't find it. But if you go and you import it to your Shopify store through AliExpress, obviously using the overload tool, it's definitely gonna be a product that you can actually sell and you can actually be, you know, uh, you can actually know that's gonna arrive in a high quality manner, right? So obviously check out the branding, the, I'm sorry, the brand of the supplier and see the ratings if it's a top brand. If it's a top brand, you know, I can actually trust with them with my eyes closed. And then also check out if it has e-packet, check also the testing. Also, if you see the feedback and you see a nice picture, you can actually use that picture to actually run an ad if it, it's a good quality because people like seeing how it actually looks on them, how it actually, the product looks on use. So if you can actually see super high quality picture, you can actually know also what people appreciate and what people value of this product. So you can actually leverage that on your ad. So people say, I love this product because it's the fastest. I love this product because it's the softest. I love this product because it's not like other one because other ones are too itchy or something like that. You can actually be like, specify and leverage that and say this is the softest product or the fastest if it's like something you really want to be to be fast it just depends on the product you are selling so it doesn't matter what the product is you can actually find what people value of this product to leverage that through instagram uh influencers through facebook and actually grow and make a lot more money than people are just, that are just like sharing a picture a blank picture a simple picture from you know AliExpress and not having a, not adding adding any value, guys. So I think I gave you a lot. See the orders, all right? 
see the orders, see the feedback, check out the pictures, use the picture, and also check the, uh, the, the also the supplier and the rating it has. If it's a top brand, also check the other products. And that's an awesome way to find products that nobody actually has ever seen before, but are actually are willing and are being are going to become hot selling products if you actually run ads, or run Instagram uh, shout outs for them. So I hope you like this video, guys. Make sure you actually subscribe if you haven't so and hit the notification bell. Last live stream was amazing. A lot of people got a lot of value. I mean, people thank me for the value. We had a lot of fun. Also, people laughed a lot. So make sure you also hit the notification bell, subscribe, like the video guys, like this video and also share with your friends and make sure you leave and drop a comment. It could be as simple as thank you so much, I mean uh, I've learned this or I didn't know it's possible to do this video, just anything you want guys, all right? Help me grow my YouTube channel to 10K. That's to check out my dropshipping, uh, my Shopify dropshipping master's course, which is also a mentorship program. All right, guys, I want to become your mentor and I want to help you go and stop working a nine to five or working any job for anyone else and start working for you and becoming your own boss. Really, that's to go, right? It's, it's beautiful being and having time for yourself and having time to do anything you want and not, you know, working for other ones, guys. It's not about the money sometimes. It's about, you know, the, the, the freedom of your time, being, time, being free to actually, you know, all right, today I want to be with my family. Today I want to be out with my friends and not be like, okay, I got to go to work tomorrow. I can't go out. No, that's the beauty of being an entrepreneur. And that's also the beauty of starting a dropshipping business. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.